hi welcome you all to pebbles last class we have seen a uh, multiplication and division a uh, multiplication and division of fractions and also we have seen word problems so today we are going to continue the same topic word problems now look at the sum let's start the class word problems first question Ankana did 3/8 of her homework on Saturday and 1/4 of the 1/4 of the homework on Sunday how much of the homework did she do over the weekend I'll repeat the question Ankana did 3/8 of her homework on Saturday and 1/4 of the homework on Sunday how much of the homework did she do over the weekend so do you understand the question before you are going to solve the sum that means word problem you have to read the question at least once or twice then you have to identify whether the question is addition or subtraction or multiplication or division so we already have given the clue for addition and subtraction so now you understand how much how much of the homework so that is a important clue word so how much of the homework did she do over the weekend that means overall overall that means how much means in this place uh, for the next uh, for the for the two days saturday she has completed 3/8 of the homework 3/8 fraction of the homework and sunday she has completed that is 1/4 of the homework whether she completed or she has to complete so uh, she has to Uh, what she has to do the homework within the two days. That is what how much of the homework that was how much of the homework that is total homework to for the two days overall the overall the two days how much she has to complete the work complete the homework that is the question. So solution I've written. Ankana did homework on Saturday. Ankana did homework on Saturday. So did means in that place she has completed. Okay, not she has to complete. She has completed. That is, uh, sorry, I said. Okay, Ankana did homework on Saturday. So, so she has completed the homework on Saturday. That is three eight, three eight fraction, three by eight fraction. Next, Ankana did homework on Sunday. Ankana did homework on Sunday. That is one by four fraction. So she has completed the homework on Sunday. That is one by four. One by four fraction. Next, she did the homework on the over the weekend. That is, weekend means you know that Saturday and Sunday the weekend. She did the homework over the weekend. So within the two days, weekend means Saturday and Sunday. Within the two days, she has completed how much portion she has completed. That is the question. How much portion? That is how much fraction she has completed on the completed. How much portion she has completed over the weekend? Or how much portion she has completed within the two days? that is the exact question they asked you so now we are going to solve the sum so look at this i've written already so saturday this much of portion that is 3 by 8 uh, 3 by 8 fraction and sunday she has completed that she did the homework 1 by 4 fraction so she did the homework over the weekend so in the weekend that means saturday within the two days saturday and sunday she has completed how much portion of work so that that understood it is the addition so we are going to add both fraction that is 3 by 8 plus 1 by 4 so look at this the both denominators are different so what you're going to do the de denominators are different means you have to take lcm so take the lcm 8 comma 4 so you have to take that is 4 2 and 1 sorry 4 2 and 1 2 and 1 again so 2 One and one, so four into two, you can get eight. So write that LCM, LCM of eight comma four is what? Eight. So you have to write that is here three by eight plus one by four. So what are you going to do? So three by eight means in that place. Sorry. So three by eight. What you are going to do? That is three by eight means the LCM is eight. LCM is what? That is least common multiples. You have to take LCM. That means you have to make the denominators are equal or same. So three by eight. So you have to multiply. LCM is eight. So you have to multiply by one. 
so what you get again you must get 3 by 8 so here next is 1 by 4 so what you're going to do you have to multiply by 2 the denominator so the numerator also multiply by 2 so you can get 2 by 8 now look at this sum so now the denominators are same what is the answer 3 by 8 plus 2 by 8 you can get that is 5 by 8 5 by 8 5 by 8 is the what answer because now the LCM now the denominators are that is denominator or common denominators 8 or LCM are 8 so if the denominator is same you have to add the numerator so you must add the numerator so 3 plus 2 we can get 5 by 8 5 is a numerator and 8 is a denominator the answer is answer in what fraction proper fraction proper fraction so look at the sum in this place she did the home she did the homework over the weekend what is the answer it's 5 by 8 what is it 5 by 8 so you can get the answer is here 5 by 8 so how can you get 5 by 8 because you have to take the LCM after that you know, first you have to take the LCM then you have to you have to what make the uh, different denominator as same as a common denominator then if the denominator are same you have to add the numerator then you can get the final answer is 5 by 8 so this is the exact answer for this question so what you are going to do she did the homework over the weekend so you have to write it again she did the homework she did the homework over the weekend so this much of portion this much of what fraction she has to come she has to complete no it's not she has to complete she had completed okay 5 by 8 5 by 8 fraction she did the homework over the weekend so this is the answer that means she had completed over the weekend 5 by 8 fraction that's the answer for the question